wrap up Women's History Month, I've got someone really special to tell you about. Her name is Dr. Martine Rothblatt. May not be a name you know, but it's one you really should because she is ferocious, successful, effective, and so impressive. Um, Dr. Rothblatt was born to a Jewish family in Chicago. She got a PhD, a JD, an MBA. Lots of letters after her name, but that's not the beginning of what's impressive about her. She started in the field of satellite communications. She developed and launched Sirius Satellite Radio. She went to uh, University of Maryland College Park to study astronomy, but she was recruited by NASA. She led the project to develop the Universal Declaration on the Human Genome and Human Rights that was endorsed by the United Nations in 1998. She came out as transgender in 1994 at the age of 40, which was really early for that risk. She has become a vocal advocate for transgender rights. Now, here comes even more amazing stuff about Dr. Rothblatt, but wait, there's more. After her daughter was diagnosed with pulmonary hypertension in 1994, Dr. Rothblatt founded United Therapeutics. It's based in Silver Spring, in the heart of Silver Spring in District 20, to work on developing a medication to manage the condition. In 2023, the revenue of United Therapeutics, just to give you a sense of this company, was 2.3 billion with a B and had almost 1,000 employees. She is an airplane and helicopter pilot with night vision goggle certification. But wait, there's more. In 2017, Forbes magazine named Dr. Rothblatt one of the 100 greatest living business minds of the past century, with special reference to her roles as, quote, a perpetual reinventor, founder of Sirius and United Therapeutics, and creator of Pan Am Sat, that's a satellite. In 2019, Dr. Rothblatt was recognized as uh, one of Business Insider's most powerful LBGTQ plus people in tech. The National Business Aviation Association gave her its highest honor, the Meritorious Service to Aviation Award. I'm getting near the end, but there's still a few more things. In April of last year, she was given the Benjamin Franklin Medal for Distinguished Achievement in the Science from the uh, Sciences from the American Philosoph Philosophical Society. And just last week, Mr. President, the governor gave her the International Leadership Award. She lives with her wife, Bina, and their children. Dr. Rothblatt has been a ferocious and successful leader, role model, an inspirational person. She lives in Maryland, and we should be so proud. I am honored for the opportunity to brag about her and share some of her many, many, many accomplishments with you all today. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you, Senator. Thank you.